I'd gotten some feedback on the dovetail jig and people are really happy about it. But one of the things that I did to improve it was I mounted the post on the other side. So originally the post was on the bottom side of the angle and now I've mounted it on the opposite side and what that does is it allows you to cut your half pins without needing support of another board. Before you had to bring it out here and bring it in but now because of the post being mounted on the opposite side we can cut our half pins without needing any extra support. What that also allows us to do is use it as a chisel guide which really helps with very clean dovetails. So I'm gonna show you how to use this as a chisel guide. So you take your chisel, put it right into your knife line. You wanna use a wider chisel to use this as a chisel guide to make sure you get complete coverage. And just pare down. To use the jig for waste clearing, you want to turn the jig upside down and put your chisel in your knife line and then slide your jig up to it. This will ensure that one, your chisel is cutting where it needs to be and, and two, that it is 90 degrees to your workpiece. Here's how you do the pin sides. Again, it's a lot easier if you use a bigger chisel so you have a good reference area. And what I do is put it against and pull it right against my pin, pull it up and just slide it over ever so slightly. And you can just, and you get a perfect line there. And it just cuts the cleanest chisel line. Just cleans it up so nicely. Now, it just so happens we need to clean a sliver off of this shoulder. And so you can use the shoulder side of your jig. Just give it a little shaving and we know that that's going to be a perfect 90 degrees. There you go. 